The fifth setting on the system settings is review website settings. And this is where we're going to upload the links to the review sites where we want our customers to review us. So go ahead and click on review website settings and it will load this page. Now notice that I've already preloaded three of the review websites, but I want to show you how I found these and how to upload those. So one of the best ways to find the review sites where you're currently already listed on is to go to Google and do a search for reviews of and then type in your business name. Now when I did this, I found that we're already listed on Yelp and City Search, which I've already preloaded. And the only thing I haven't preloaded at this point is a Merchant Circle. So let me click on uh, Essential Marketing Systems under Merchant Circle. And you see here's our listing for Essential Marketing Systems. Now there are two things that are really important once you get to the, your page on the internet. The first thing is you want to make sure that you are not signed in to that service, whether it's Google or Merchant Circle or whatever. And the way to do that is to come up here at the top and here where it says log in or join now, that indicates to me that I am not logged in. If it said hi Bob or welcome Bob, that would tell me I am logged in. It's important that you are logged out when you do what I'm going to show you because your customers are not going to be logged in with your account. So make sure you're logged out. The second thing is, even though it's very obvious to me that I can click here to write a review, I want to get as close to the review process as I can for my customers. So I'm going to click on write a review and I want to notice if one of two things happen. Am I, with, with, again, this is without being signed in. When I click on that write a review, am I immediately prompted to sign in? If I am, I've gone too far. If I click on this button and I'm taken one step closer to where a customer can leave a review, that's a good thing. So let's see what happens with Merchant Circle. Okay, so when I click on Merchant Circle, I'm still not asked to sign in, which is great. And right here, I'm taken to write a review about Essential Marketing Systems, really easy. Now keep in mind, when your customers leave a review, uh, virtually on every site, they're going to be asked to set up an account. Some of the review sites ask you to set up an account before you leave a review, some after. Now Merchant Circle obviously does it after. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going up here into the address bar and I'm going to copy this full address right here because this is the link I want to send people to. So I'm going to just copy that. I'm going to go back into the system settings and under site title I'm going to type in Merchant Circle which is right there and then I'm going to paste the URL that I just copied right there and then I'm going to click on save review site and when I do that you'll see that Merchant Circle let me scroll down is now one of the review sites right here now the other thing is once you've uploaded all of your review sites you definitely want to test it so I'm going to go ahead and click on the test button and let's see if it in fact works. And sure enough, I'm taken right there. Now it is interesting. Oh, look at that. Merchant Circle took me right to where I want to go. It's jumping around a little bit. You can see where it's going. All right, that is really good news. So that test worked. And before you send the first review request out to your customers, you want to make sure that you test every one of these um, uh, review sites. Now the other thing I want to share with you is you can include as many review sites as you want. I encourage you to keep it between three and maybe five. If you get above five, it becomes very confusing. And let me show you what your customers are going to see. Now in my case, I've got City Search, Yelp, Google, and Merchant Circle. So when someone goes into our system to write a review, those are the review sites that they're going to see. City Search, Yelp, Google, and Merchant Circle. And you can organize these in any manner that you want. Now, I encourage you, the three big ones are actually Google, who's the 800-pound gorilla in the review business, Yelp, and Yelp is not for every industry, but Yelp is huge. It's the fastest-growing review site out there. If you are in the travel business, TripAdvisor is going to be big. Um, um, not so much with Merchant Circle, but there are, there are other ways. And please contact us if you want to talk about what review sites are the best for your business and your location. Uh, that's a conversation that we'll definitely have with you as a, a part of the setup. And you can also organize these. Now, uh, since Google is the most important and Yelp is the second most important, I would want to reorganize these on this page. So let's go back into the system and I can click on change site order. So let me do that. And in this case, I want to move Google to the top. So I'm going to grab these little hash bars and move Google to the top. I want City Search to be second. I'm sorry, Yelp to be second and City Search third and Merchant Circle. Then I'll click on the Save button. Now, once I've done that, if I go back into my system and refresh it, 
you should see that those all change. And see, that's how they change. So you want them in the order of the one that the customers are most likely to suggest first. All right, so let's go back to review website settings. And the other thing you can do is if you want to disable one, like for example, if I don't want Merchant Circle to show anymore, but I don't want to just get rid of it, if I click on the Enable button, it will turn to Disable. Uh, then what I can do is go back into the system here, hit the F5 button, and Merchant Circle should disappear just like that. So there are times when you're going to want to do that. All right, so that is how you set up your review website settings. In the next video, we're going to talk about the review request settings.